Somaliland. Uh, the state which is not recognized uh, by the international community or, or, or any government, but the state who have all those flags and history and used to be a member of UN uh, and recognized by 35 countries once, but again joined with another country and when that union doesn't work, we go out of that union and nobody recognizes. So that's the history. Now, Somaliland is a livestock uh, country which, which completely depends on livestock. Uh, and we have around uh, 20 to 25 million heads of livestock. Uh, this is the export population, as you see, the years. Those are the uh, uh, camel, cattle, sheep, goat. The total we export usually, uh, I mean, uh, yearly. This, as you see, the livestock. This is a particular breed which is only found in that country. If you see a sheep with that black head, that's only in Somaliland. And of course, camel and those things. Now, this picture is why we bought it, because of the recent drought. Recent drought are all week, and we are showing, you know, what happened to that country and how it came. It came a desert almost, you know, as you see. We have to move with the change, the climate change, uh, introduce a lot of change uh, to, to our country. And we used to be a completely pastoralist, you know, there was no agro, agro pastoral, but all pastoralist. People move like that, and they move all around the country. Now we have to change that system with the help of, uh, of course, we cannot do it with the international community. And we have to come with system like, uh, you know, uh, fattening or feeding or producing a folder, uh, increasing water production because you see the waters we have. So a lot of things and we have a plan. Those are the plans we have, uh, you know, uh, uh, those points, recruiting, drought, resolution from the climate change, livestock, import ban. You know, import ban is a problem we have because when, the, when, when we, we, we export a life and when it's banned, it's always a problem. Uh, what we really want to be done is to, to change the, the, the way of life, this, uh, this pastoral is, you know, the way of life. And we have to shift it slowly, not one time we can do it, uh, to at least make uh, Percent of the people, pastoralists, you know, farming and, and, and having their, their animal in a farm, not moving like that in the dry area. Increase production, it's like folder, uh, the, the animal feeding things. Increase water, and drill, drill a lot of uh, bore holes and make, you know, uh, water available everywhere. People to, 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 to be able to farm and, and have their, uh, you know, livestock in that farm. Uh, and of course, uh, uh, as I told you, we have a, we have a five, five years plan, which, is, uh, which I don't have it now, and which we put it all the budget of the government, 50% uh, of the budget we have all that five years uh, in the plan to, to, to add value livestock and, and, and the pastoralists and the people who, who you know. Okay. So I think that in Somaliland is a bit drier, drier areas. Yeah. And I think that forage and feeds are limitations there. Yeah. Yeah. So what type of what type of work do you have to improve that? Do you have some work on feed and forage improvement? That's what I was saying. Now we are, we have a five years plan, which mostly addresses uh, uh, folded production. And uh, rehabilitation of a lot of, uh, you know, land, which is, which is you know, uh, and, and, and we, we receive a lot of water, rain water in a year, and that all water goes to the sea. So now we try, we're catching that water, we're making dams, we're catching the water. Uh, so once, once you get water, you can get a grass. When you have, this place you have water now, you can irrigate it and have a grass. So, we are going to catch the water. We are going to drill a lot of uh, bore holes, uh, wells, and get water. So well, I just want to know what type of forage species you have planned to plant, or what type of forage species, tree species like, for example? Well, trees, it's not like this. Uh, trees we have, we have a plenty. Some places are very forest. We have a lot of different trees, and every kind is available. 
But of course, uh, rain, raining season became less, the climate change. It's not raining as usual. So you see, this is a well now, area open, but you see the trees and everything is there. Now, because there's no raining, there's no grass growing. So we have to catch that water. We have to make uh, uh, holding grounds we made. Now we make five holding grounds. Now, in addition 60. to the water, you need adaptable seeds, yeah? We have the seeds. So where, where, where did you source? No, no, seeds we have. Seeds we have. You see, we have a 20 million livestock and they're living there. And we have the seeds, all kind of seeds. But because of uh, rain become less, not as usual. So that's that's the problem now. And we have to uh, we have to make sub, uh, you know, subsidiary things to, to uh, fodder production, uh, animal food production. We have to make that. And we have to catch the water which is going to the sea, stop it here.